zero, none, negative zero. These are all values that are simply too high to describe the chance of Mother 3 appearing at this year's Summer Nintendo Direct. But one can dream, right? There's been leaks and rumors about Game Boy and Game Boy Advance games coming to Nintendo Switch Online. Earthbound and Earthbound Beginnings both just made it on Nintendo Switch Online. Shigesato Wii Toy wants people to play his games. There was just a Mother Direct, an absolutely gorgeous tribute, a documentary from Nintendo Life. Live Alive is getting a localization. Reggie wants Mother 3. Terry Crews wants Mother 3, which is obviously the most impactful detail of this argument. My point is that this is the closest we've been to Mother 3 since it was re-released on the Japanese Wii U eShop in 2016. Despite a lot of these not directly relating to Mother 3, all of this hype just invokes something inside me. I feel a climax coming. All of this has to lead up to something incredible. I mean, if Elden Ring and Silk Song can actually exist, so can Mother 3, right? Right? No. Probably not. This may be the closest we've ever gotten to Mother 3, but in reality, we really don't have anything resembling a lead. It's been a popular conversation topic recently, sure, but there hasn't been any evidence leading to the miraculous conclusion we're all hoping for. But that's okay. It's okay that we won't get Mother 3, because no matter what happens, Mother is always with us. It's a series that will always stick with you, and not only is the series itself with us, but its disciples as well. Amori just released on Switch, One Shot is releasing on Switch in the near future, Toby Fox is working hard on Deltarune Chapter 3, heck, we just had a direct with like 20 Mother games in it. It's okay that we won't get Mother 3, because there's a plethora of beautiful games coming out in the future, those being genuine pieces of art that are going to stick with so many people that will impact them in ways they don't even realize yet. It's okay that we won't get Mother 3, because no matter what happens, somebody's dream is going to come true. Think about the potential, we might finally get to see a glimpse of Metroid Prime 4, Bane and the 3 will probably have a release release date, a new Breath of the Wild 2 trailer, and GBA games on them so it doesn't seem too unlikely. So many people will get to experience games like Minish Cap, Blazing Blade, Metroid Zero Mission Infusion, Golden Sun, maybe Golden Sun will even have a remake, or Golden Knight gets released on NSO N64, I'm getting carried away, and I haven't even scratched the surface. Just look at this bingo card I made. It's okay that we won't get Mother 3, because no matter what happens, we're going to have fun. If it's the best direct ever, then we all give one big huzzah and become incredibly excited for what's to come. If it's abysmal, then there will be some hilarious YouTube videos and we'll just go back to whatever we were doing beforehand with some fun new memories of bashing a billion dollar company. If we get Mother 3, we all pop off, cry, and pre-order with a big ol' smile on our faces. If we don't get Mother 3, we all laugh it off, make some new memes, and go to sleep with big ol' smiles on our faces knowing that the rest of the community is doing the same. So to seriously answer the title of this video, the chance chances of Nintendo showing anything Mother 3 related at the upcoming Nintendo Direct are low, but not zero, and likely forever will be. This is okay because we still have access to an incredible fan translation, incredible projects inspired by the games we love, and an incredible community who we can suffer together with. I guess what I'm trying to say is, maybe lower the hype, but don't lower the hope. Because I believe in miracles. I swear I've seen a few. Consider what I said, and no matter what happens, have fun this summer. That's the most important thing. Now let's go watch that direct, shall we?